Ohio Governor John Kasich comes to Northeast Ohio one day after unveiling his $55 billion budget plan. It's a plan that does not raise taxes, but it does contain some steep cuts in order to fill an $8 billion shortfall. Governor Kasich talked to seniors today at Fairhill Partners in Cleveland about his budget. News Channel 5's John Kasich joins us now. John, you were there with the governor. How was the governor received? Well, Liam, it was actually a warm reception, but one tempered by concerns about how the governor plans to reform Medicaid and in turn the programs that tend to seniors. Speaking to seniors and those who work with them, Governor John Kasich today outlined his plan to reform Medicaid. Some of those reforms include giving seniors a greater say in their care. We do not want our senior citizens to go back to a kindergarten stage where everybody tries to tell you what to do when you're three, four, five years old. Your senior citizens, you deserve respect and independence and comfort and health. Part of that is expanding programs that allow seniors to stay in their own home if they choose rather than go into a nursing home, while at the same time keeping a closer eye on those paid to provide the home services. We don't want home health care workers to come in, uh, be in a bad mood, take your blood pressure, slap something down on the table and go out the door. We expect them to have quality as well, and we intend to measure that. First glance at the budget, though, raises a few flags with those who deal with the elderly. They're cutting, for instance, passport operational costs by 15 percent, services by 8 percent, provider rates by 3 percent. You know, those cuts are going to make it more difficult to sustain quality services for the consumers. Since Medicaid is divided among seven agencies, the governor says some cuts were not really cuts, just services move from one agency to another. Bonnie gave up a half a billion dollars. Not that it isn't going to be spent, but it's been moved to a place where we can have matching federal dollars to bring more dollars into the state. And Medicaid is the state's largest single budget item, a third of the budget. And as the governor mentioned, because it is spread over seven different agencies, they want to try to save in part by reducing some of the duplications and overlaps. Live in the newsroom, Sean Kosick, News Channel 5.